Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're diving into a common challenge faced by many Android developers. Our viewer is exploring the bottom navigation view component and has a question about customizing the text and icon colors on item selection. Here's a quick overview of the problem. The viewer has set up a bottom navigation view with four menu items, but only the first item changes color when selected. They want to distinguish between selected and deselected items using different colors, but it seems their current configuration isn't working as expected. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll go through your question, go through the answers for it, and hopefully that brings you to your solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy to get to that solution just like me. And let's get started. Let's start by understanding the issue with your bottom navigation view. You want to change the text and icon tint based on the selected and deselected states of the menu items. You have already created a color state list named menu score select deselect.xml. This file defines the colors for the checked and unchecked states. However, it seems like the tint is not applied correctly to all items. The problem might be due to how the item icon tint and item text color attributes are set. Ensure that both attributes reference the color state list you created. Additionally, make sure that your menu items are properly defined in menuproductdetails.xml. Each item should have a unique ID and icon. Finally, if the issue persists, check if there are any conflicting styles or themes applied to your bottom navigation view that might override your settings. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. In this solution, the user identifies a mistake in their code related to the return value in the onNavigationItemSelected method. They initially returned false, but the correct return value should be true. The user sets up a listener for the bottom navigation view handling different menu items. Each case is defined, but the return statement is crucial for proper functionality. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To change the text and icon tint on item selection in Android's bottom navigation, modify your selector file. Use the provided XML structure to define colors for enabled and disabled states. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Change the text and icon tint on item selection in Android's bottom navigation. Use drawable resources instead of color resources. Make sure to reference your drawables correctly. And that's it guys. I hope this video helped find that resolution you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.